Previously on Game of Thrones. My father is planning to make a move against your family. He knows all your weaknesses, all your plans, because you have a traitor in your council. He's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. We were told we'd be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. That's enough, Andros. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a bastard? I hope I didn't make a mistake in trusting you. And if it isn't Elena Glenmore? You're not still marrying into this wretched family. I'm sorry. I'm going to tell Father the betrothal is off. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. Marine? Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. If you presume to speak of my dragons, you best choose your words carefully. Are you going to be a good li little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down? You can be Lord Roderick, so long as we all know who holds the reins here. The foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Take the boy as your ward. Kill him if they give you any trouble. I. We bled him at first. Like a pig. I knew you were a killer the day you arrived. Seems Brit found out too. Now they all see it. What sort of brother you really are. I I'm afraid you've got the wrong man. I was further along the wall at Don't the you stand there and fucking lie to me, boy. Someone butchered that man like an animal and left him to bleed. You told me what you did to get here. We both know you had blood on your hands. But now, you've killed one of your brothers. You'll lose your head for this, Tuttle. You'll be disgraced, dishonored, and burned till there's nothing left of you. This is mad! You're going to execute- is dead because of you. There's only one thing to be done with you now. Hey, Frostfinger! I saw what Garrett did to Brit last night. 
My relief was late, so I stayed behind. I saw everything. Go on, then. Finn was only there at the very end. You had your say. Actually, I was there the whole time. Oh. Then tell us. Britt didn't do anything wrong. Garrett murdered him in cold blood. And he just left him there. Like an animal. Garrett's no brother. He's worse than the wildlings. He'd kill any one of us who looked at him funny. Britt slaughtered he my family! He was a man of the watch and you murdered him! Save your breath, Tuttle. You haven't got much of it left. Let's go! Crossfinger! What's to be done with him? We're heading to Crusted. Not with this one, you're not. Got a witness says he murdered Brit. You'll have to find someone else for your expedition. Garrod, I... I can't believe you did this. Now out of the way, Snow. Give us a moment. Then kiss him quick and be done with it. Garrod, you told me you wouldn't get into it with Brit. What happened? I thought you were smarter than that, Garrod. I thought you were going to be by my side at Crasters. But there's no coming back from this. I'm sorry I let you down, John. I didn't mean for it to come to this. You gave me your word, Garrod. It can't have been easy. Facing the man who killed your family. Aye. Uh, Is there nothing to be done? Aside from removing Tuttle's head from his shoulders? No. But you're about to go off and execute a nest full of traitors at Craster's. With you, Garrett. We're down a man, so keep your eyes open. You can go begging to your gods all you want, boy. It's the axe has the final say. false tales of my dragons? Desperate men, hoping for wealth, protection. Liars, every one of them. And I expect you are no different. You don't want to see what I do to liars. Especially those who seek to waste my time. Are you calling me a liar? You know nothing about me. You're right. I don't know you. Oh, shit. I thought you'd seen a dragon before. Reaction says otherwise. Viseron. It's all right. He's, uh... He's much smaller than the other one. Would you like to touch him? Go ahead. Unless you are afraid. Of course, a man who has really faced a dragon before may have reason to be afraid. Go on. Not a good idea, sir. You're brave, at least. <laughs> I don't think he likes me. You still have a hand, don't you? You claim you saw Drogon. 
Give me a reason to believe you. I told you I've heard this story before. I'm going to need more than that. My friend has the burns to prove it. It's likely to leave a scar. Your dragon did this, Your Grace. Well, he wouldn't. You must have tried to fight him. What have you done to him? If you've hurt him... Hurt him? He, he attacked us. Drogon wouldn't strike without reason. You must have kind of thoughtless beast. He's only a child. Oh, a child who can breathe fire on whoever he likes. If we did, I'm sorry. It wasn't our intention. We weren't looking for a fight. And neither was he. Sure he wasn't. Your tongue is dangerously sharp, sellsword. Why did you come here? You've been polite, accommodating. To what end? You want gold? A title? My undying gratitude? What do you want from me, Asher Forrester? With your permission, I want to hire him to help me fight for my family back in Westeros. The Second Sons? Has your reason failed you? Please, if you... I also came here looking for an army. But what I found were the cries of children and people suffering in chains while their masters profited from their misery. My son, your need is not greater than theirs. These are people who have suffered for years without end. What if we left after the liberation, once the slaves are free? Once the slaves are free, I will sail back to Westeros and reclaim my crown. There is no after. There must be something I can do to convince you. As we speak, my men prepare to enter Marine. What they are about to do is much bigger than you or I. Bigger than one family back in Westeros. So, unless you think you can storm Marine and free all the slaves yourself... You have nothing more to offer me, Croft. You may leave. <laughs> Beska knows the city better than anyone, Your Grace. What the hell, Asha? Is this true? <sighs> yes. I lived in Marine for a time. On the eastern side of the city. Fucking bastard. So you wish to accompany them? You'd help the Second Sons, guide them into Marine. I can't, Asher. This could be our only chance. Is that what you're saying? It could prove valuable. I can only speak for myself. I'll go alone. She's the one who knows the city. She will accompany you, or you won't be going at all. I believe that's more than fair. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into this, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. If I find you've lied or put my men in danger. I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. What the hell was that? Look, I'm sorry it happened this way. As long as you get your army, right? Beska. Get your armor patched up in here. Extra bench rolls all the where it's always fucking big. Long time since we had a piss pocket. I swear I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! 